welcome this is the energy vibration um for the um pisces i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back let's see what your message is pisces strength archangel ariel comes up in this week and it's all about strength finding inner strength to deal with whatever issues and situation that is transpired it says great inner strength release harsh judgments forgiveness and compassion so whatever is happening for you pisces is about great inner strength that you need to find in this week in order to bring you forward in a positive alignment of energy a lot of issues and city situation comes in your life and you need to release it call upon archangel ali annuel in this week and she is will give you inner strength and guidance in order to go forward um pisces this week is from the 6th until the 12th i want to say to each and every person thank you for being here thank you for returning thank you um for liking and sharing these videos go check out the full moon reading it is an eclipse full moon reading so be aware of this i'm using a new deck it is a russian deck so be aware of this uh, please uh, let go of what no longer serves you. Forgiveness is the key in this week for you, Pisces. So um, let's um, see what is happening and transpiring. So um, let's really um, see what is the energy that is coming up for you, Pisces, um, to see the energies, what is going to be affecting um, your world. a lot of past energies coming back that people like this away so let's see what is coming up the energy of the lover is here so i see some of you have some regrets about a relationship or some regrets about some um issues that you're having in your marriage okay then i see you ladies have some deep regrets you young unmarried lady have some deep regrets with a lover or a relationship that you had then i see some of you ladies with kids so you're having some issues with your kids you married ladies could be having some issues and i see that whatever is happening and transpiring the energy of the lover some of you could be finding love on the work floor or you are in love with whatever you are doing and this is good falsita is here and it's transpiring Whatever the energy is and is transpiring, I see Falsita is here. So some of you women with kids will, um, will, um, thank you. <laughs> uh, thank you. Coffee. <laughs> some of you ladies with kids will have some issues to deal with. Desperation is now over for some of you. Whatever the desperation that you were having, um, you were dealing with some false eye in your life and this is now over. Um, I see that whoever this um, this false act was is someone from another country, another um, religion or background that some of you were dealing with and there was some falseness that was coming up. So a lot of false situations. Some of you ladies are going to be receiving a letter um, and uh, for unmarried women, it is a letter from your work. Um, for you wives and uh, women with kids, it is a letter or some information about your ex-partner that is going to be coming up. I see the sadness is going to be over for you, Pisces, whatever that was happening and transpiring. Definitely the sadness is going to be over. So this is um, good, okay? However, this was happening and transpiring in the lives of you, Pisces. I see some issues with business um, that some of you, Pisces, could have been connected in business with someone from another race, religion, or background. And there was some false eye in business with this person. Sadness is going to be over and the deceptiveness and whatever you were dealing with this person from another religion or background. I see that you're going to be finding out that this person was very, very false. Okay, so let's look. So the energy of the lover is here. You men are dealing with an issue and uh, 
um, you men were in a relationship with a fire sign person, an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius. I see you could be falling in love with this person. Um, and um, there could be a new start for you and this person. So men, um, if you're looking or you're in a relationship or you um, care about a, a woman 50 years and older or a mature woman I see you will be receiving a new start if that's what you want but I see there was a whole lot of problem with this person um, you could have been married to this person or you were having some relationship issues with this person but I see you're in love with this person but your a letter is going to be coming in where it might not be a positive message okay then I see the Queen of Swords whoever this Queen of Swords is coming down on you unmarried women um, whatever the issue and the situation is I see some information is coming in to you unmarried women and it is a letter and um, whatever this letter is all about, you're going to be finding out that a Gemini woman has stabbed some of you in the back. So unmarried women, be aware of this, what is happening and transpiring. A old Gemini woman, whoever this old Gemini woman is, has stabbed some of you in the back. Then wives and ladies with kids, I see you're going to be finding out something about your partner or your children father. So you wife or women with kids, be aware some information is coming out that your partner could have been seen a fire sign woman. Yes, and this is a Leo. So whatever is transpiring, you Pisces women who are married or have kids, you could be receiving some information that your partner is in love with a Leo. Okay, so be aware of this because you ladies are going to be having some issues where you're finding out some real deceptive play from your partner. Then I see a situation with work. You're going to be overcoming whatever issues you were having with at your work. Whatever issues there was with your business or your work, you're going to be overcoming this situation. The energy of the chariot is here. It is the week of the chariot where whatever issues is, you're going to be moving forward and leaving this issue and the situation behind you. So I see that this could be affected on married women. I see you, a decision is going to be made in your favor. Whatever that was happening and transpiring, on the work floor with your business the decision is going to be made in your favor so this is wonderful and positive wonderful um, alignment of energy now this letter that is coming in um yes this oh this letter that is coming in beautiful um, this letter has to do with some information some of you are going to be receiving a letter and it is going to be bringing out some form of information that is coming in so a lot of you expect a, a letter or some information that is coming in that some of you um, could be finding out um, that um, you're in love with a fire sign woman I see you're going to be saying this to this person. It could be a mother figure for some of you. It is an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius where um, you're finding out that you could be in love, especially with people who are in love. You're finding out that you're in love with a fire sign person. But for some of you unmarried women, you're going to be receiving some letter where you realize that a Gemini have stabbed you in the back. A Gemini woman have stabbed you in the back. So this is going to be good. Falsita has to do with um, um, whatever is transpire. Some false eye, to, but still your wishes and dream is going to be coming true because um, whatever is transpiring, it is about your business for some of you Pisces. And it has to do with some problem and issues that you're going to be coming out of. And a decision is going to be made in your favor. But for you women with children, the information that is coming out is that your partner was seen a fire sign woman. But your wishes and dream is going to come true because I think that some of you wanted to release yourself from this relationship or this marriage anyway. 
and I see the energy of the lovers is coming in so some of you are going to be receiving um, what you were hoping for in a relationship or some unexpected luck is going to be coming in where you and your partner is going to be very very lucky so whether man men or women there was some injustice or some uh, deceptive situation that plays against you Pisces um, with your partner and I see that you're going to be overcoming um, this and your wishes and dreams is going to be coming out for if you were a married couple and there was some falseness that was created in your world I see a resolution is going to be coming out and you and your partner is going to be happily overcoming some false act and deceptiveness that was created if some of you were in a relationship with a Capricorn or some of you were in love with a Capricorn I see um, victory and success for you and uh, this person whoever this Capricorn is if once you were married or in a relationship with a Capricorn or you were in love with a Capricorn I see that you're going to be reconnecting with this Capricorn and it's going to be good the desperation is over okay desperation is uh, definitely over some of you um, are not you know you're um, putting down your guard um, and you are receiving some information um, very desperate desperation is here um, very desperate about your marriage desperate about your business so there is some desperation that is here desperate about some information that is coming out about a leo so let's say that you were in a relationship with a leo some of you are going to be finding out some information about this leo that you were not aware of and this is going to be is as if you lose your power um, um against this leo or you lose your power because you um, thought that this person was honest and you're realizing that this Leo or this person that you were dealing with or this situation wasn't in the best form so it could be a situation where some of you were seeing a Leo um, as a side piece chick or that sort of a thing because it's in the situation that has to do with your business and the lover but you're finding out some information about this Leo and that is creating some desperation because whatever the information that is coming at you, Pisces about a Leo is going to bring you some desperation. It could be a Leo who is a family member, that sort of a thing. Now I see um, um, some issues and situation um, with a Libran from another race or culture. You're going to be finding out some um, dishonorable um, information that is coming in that... Um, this person and you it's going to give you some bittersweet feelings so whoever this liberal is and whoever this person is some information is coming in it could be that you have a legal issue with someone in another city another state and whatever the information is coming in is going to be a bittersweet information about this liberal okay so you got to be aware of this person and whatever has been happening and transpiring because uh, a whole lot of you could be having some legal issues. Some of you could be um, also receiving the message of divorce. If you were married to an, um, a Libran, I see whatever is going on, it is bittersweet, the Eight of Cups. I see this Libran, if you were married to a Libran, this person wants to end the marriage or the relationship, okay? So, um, obviously, um, whoever this person is, they are thinking about moving on and end this marriage or this relationship with you Pisces men or women, okay? So a lot is happening in this week for you guys. <sighs> a whole lot of sadness. For some of you, the sadness is going to be over. For some of you, the sadness is going to be here that you have to deal with um, a situation with your marriage or with someone who you're connected with, with a relationship. I see truths are coming out. A whole lot of truths are coming out because people are really, um, um, they, nine of swords and the ten of swords is here and the ten of swords has to do with um some of you ladies are in the reverse where you're going to be finding out that a friend a girlfriend could stab you in your back okay 
and then I see the energy with desperation is that some of you are desperate because there's some issues with um, you and your partner your relationship maybe um, there is some false play that is at hand but I see happiness and joy with the marriages so be uh, um, um, optimism with whoever is married or in a relationship I see happiness and joy but for the rest if you are married to a, a Leo or um, a Libran I see an end is coming up to the relationship so be aware of that the center is that communication and a letter is coming in that is going to be bringing some information out to you guys I gotta go namaste until next time like share these videos